Hello, good afternoon. This video is going to show you how to create a new research project in Noodle Tools and how to share it with the teacher's project inbox. Okay. <clears throat> so when you log into Noodle Tools, you're going to see a page that looks all like this. You probably won't have any projects listed, although you may if you've used it for other classes. So I have another personal project that I'm working on. So I want you to click where it says new project. Okay, enter project title. Will you please include your name? It's helpful for me as the teacher when I see students' names. So first put your name. And uh, I've already made a practice one of these so you can see where it's suggesting the title to me. I'm now gonna write the title of my book, Boys Without Names, and then research. Okay, now it's gonna offer me MLA. That is the one I wanna keep, MLA. That is the style that we use in the humanities department. Next, citation level. Will you please choose junior? If you were in high school, I'd say choose advanced, but we're going to start with junior, okay? And then you're going to click submit. Give it a second to load your project. Okay, this is my project dashboard. It's not very exciting, but it's a great place to get started, and I'm going to come back to this and explain um, kind of what we're going to do on this. Uh, but the first thing we want to do is we want to share this with a project inbox. If you notice down here where it says sharing, okay? So I'm going to click share with a project inbox. Now, it already has my name down here, but you would put your name in there. Now, because I own the project inbox, uh, it will not pop up for me, but it will for you. The project inbox is named Griswold. If you start typing that, it should pop up. Then you want to if, if, make sure that it says seventh grade norms and taboos, okay? It's going to pop up a, a match for you, and you're going to click it. And then you want to click share paper and then done, okay? All right, so that's what you're going to do to start sharing your paper so that your teacher can view what you're working on as you are researching. Okay, thank you so much. That video showed you how to share your project with a project inbox. Thank you.